What up, y'all? GBZ here. Um, just got a couple collections, and hopefully we can go ahead and get Rick. So I did hit all the milestones and raids and uh, the level up tourney uh, that just finished out. So, you know, those three guaranteed Benedicts. I do like that it's three guaranteed um, Benedicts. Um, that's something I do like in raid tournament, the, the raid tournaments now. Um, you know, also that you had two days, which I really liked as well, you know, so you definitely had time. Uh, even if, you know, you were low on cans, you know, you could use regular energy. Um, you know, um, that I really liked, you know, that, that, that like, it's again, three guaranteed Benedicts. Um, and, you know, the milestones for raids. Um, you know, and also that we had plenty of time to do it. So let's go ahead and go into the museum. And also, I was actually pretty lucky. I actually got four 100 badge drops. Um, so I was actually pretty lucky. So you're gonna go ahead and claim these um, because they were dropping in the museum. Um, you know, so, I mean, in the museum, in raids. Um, you know, which I was really happy about. Um, they were dropping in raids. Um, and they're still dropping in raids, um, but, uh, the amount is actually a lot more than last week. Last week, they were only dropping in, like, increments of, like, you know, one to five. Um, but this week, you know, like, if you were lucky, you did get, um, you know, 100, you know, dropping, uh, which, which I did, you know, and I was really happy about that. Um, as to after uh, I claim Rick, um... I'm gonna be honest, um, especially after watching, um, you know, if you go to Just the Box Gaming, you know, he, he made a, he's this awesome YouTuber, um, always on point with everything, um, you know, he made a video comparing the stash to, uh, the second stash, um, to the wheel, yep, there we go, got enough, um, and yeah, it looks like um I'll probably end up doing the second second stash. I won't actually finish it. Um I won't actually finish it. Um or get his weapon, but um it's you have guaranteed tier three gear, guaranteed tier four gear, GPSs, um Canteens, Lilith, Ulysses, um there's like a pack with like three or four basils in it. So and that's a guaranteed too, you know, so overall I think that's better. Um but anyway, I'm gonna stop commenting here. Um, and I'm probably going to end up speeding this up, but here we go. Let's get Rick.
Alright, halfway there. All right, and last one. And the last pack of five, two basils, nice. There he is, <laughs> finally. Um, I actually got him earlier than expected. Um, like a lot earlier than I expected. You know, um, mostly because like I said, I got, you know, four 100 badge drops. Um, you guys know, 5 star, um, he gets 30 attack, uh, very large AP to fast characters when attacking, um, 550 damage, uh, to one enemy, three enemies get elusive, up to three enemies get elusive, three teammates get elusive, why do I always say enemies, teammates? Um, 6 star, this guy is just a, a damage dealer, damage dealer. Um, you know, leader skill, all fast teammates get huge AP, and 40% attack. Uh, 550 damage to one enemy up to three teammates get elusive so uh, really pretty solid overall uh, especially if you know with his leader skill um, yeah really happy about this all right uh, and this is the second stash um, you know one pull is 375 but as you can see um, you are guaranteed tier 3 tier 4 gear uh, which I do like uh, as opposed to the wheel, which you can get three star gear and stuff like that. So at least in, in this one you have You know the best you can get practice dummies tripods, you know knife sheaths um, You know worst case, you know, you're getting Worst case you're getting what is that a, like a pack of five bat uh, Brady's which actually isn't bad a pack of five, you know three star trainers isn't bad um, three basils, which actually isn't bad. Three four-star trainers, not bad, you know. So you can get gauntlets, you know, so hand crank radios, military watches. And these are all guaranteed. So, uh, you know, like, I, it's... I'm probably going to end up, you know, going this route, even though it is 375 per pull. Uh, I think it would just be better since, like, I know what I'm actually going to get, as opposed to, like, 
the wheel, which is like is absolute RNG. Um, but yeah, guys, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and lock up my trainers. I feel like my roster is like way over capacity. Yeah, oh my gosh, 363. Um, yeah, I'm gonna lock up my both. Well, definitely lock up your trainers, guys. Yeah, I know I definitely have a lot of three stars to sell. Um, because since I haven't been doing Ascendants um, anymore, because uh, I got the Rick from the museum. Um, I got that Rick that I needed from the museum. You know, I'm like, okay, I don't need to. Um, I'm having a lot of duplicates. Uh, and also, you know, I have been getting uh, three stars from basic tokens as well. So, uh, but I'm going to go ahead and save these guys. But, um, yeah, let me know how you guys are liking Rise to Power. Um, I, I do like, you know, how they switched it up with raids, um, you know, and how the drops were better. Like, you know, you have, you can definitely have a better chance of getting, you know, like, uh, a 20 badge drop, um, you know, um, or a hundred, you know, so that's something I really liked. Um, did I get any? Yeah, it's good. But, um, but yeah, overall, I mean, I, I do like, you know, the roadmaps and stuff. And I like that at least, you know, you have a, you can, you can definitely get Rick, um, free to play. I mean, it's, uh, don't take my word for it. Um, but, you know, I think, you know, if you have been, you know, hitting the milestones, at least, you know, trying with raids and, you know, you've been getting okay drops, um, you, you can, you can definitely get them. Um, that, and also that you know, they have power tokens, you know, in, uh, in rewards now, so. Um, no, you, you, you can definitely get them, uh, free to play. At the, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure you can get them. I mean, even if, you know, you're not getting like, you know, the top 100, you know, um, you know, at least you're getting power tokens, you're getting power tokens, um, you know, via, uh, you know, tournaments. So, um, but yeah, that's all I got for now. Um. Yeah, that's all I got for now. So, so many Persona trainers. Um, oh, yeah, where's Rick? I gotta, I gotta lock him up. Where's Rick? Uh, where are you? There he is. Great. Um, but, yeah, that's all I got for now. Uh, I'm probably going to sell some three stars. Yeah, I have so many, you know, because I've gotten them from uh, basic tokens, you know, legendary training, as you guys saw, all the, as you guys see in my videos, you know, legendary training. Um, and yeah, there's no point in keeping them. I, I like to keep one of each, though. Um, but other than that, yeah, the these guys are just taking up roster space. And let's see. <laughs> Look at those mirror bells. Okay, I think, uh, any other ones? Yeah. Okay, nice, and, oh my gosh, I'm still over capacity. Alright, so probably in the next level up, um, I'll use them, um, some of those trainers. But, uh, yeah, special like button, let me know in the comments how things are going for you. Line ID is in the description. Message me if you have any questions or video requests. And of course, most importantly, the most important thing I could ask you guys to do, subscribe for more content. GB said, out.